This is the Cobra Tire Tool. Its unique design and shape allows you to quickly and efficiently remove a bicycle tire from the rim. In this video, we're going to show you how to use this tool and the benefits of using the tool. If you do not have strong hands or arms, you can use this tool very quickly, effectively, and efficiently to remove a bike tire faster than any other tool in the market. I like to say you don't have to be arm strong to use it. What we're going to do is get the tire in a position that we can work on. Once it's deflated, make sure that the tire is completely broken away from the rim. Once that seal is broken, we can get the tool inside to make it work. This is the tire engagement head. This is what we want to put underneath the bead of the tire and lift it out over the rim. To hook the tool underneath the bead of the tire, we want to break the tire down, insert the tool, and raise it up underneath the bead. Be careful not to get the inner tube involved because we may pinch the inner tube. Once we're at this point here, we can hook the tool either onto the seat stay or the chain stay. In this video, we're going to hook it onto the chain stay since there's nothing there and it's nice and easy. Rotate the tire around. Hook the U portion of the tool over the frame. Then rotate the tire counterclockwise. By doing so, we lock the tool in position and it's ready to go. Simply rotate the tire. It doesn't take much effort. Rotate the tire and what we're doing is removing the tire from the rim by turning it, just like a tire changer for your car. You can easily access the inner tube. You can repair the inner tube at this point or replace the tube. Once you've exposed the inner tube and you decide that you want to replace it, at this point you can now release the rim from the frame and drop it off to put your new tube in. But do not release the tire from the frame until you've done this type of work here. We want to utilize all the leverage that we have by rotating the tire and allowing it to do the work for us. Once you've either repaired or replaced the inner tube and you're reinstalling the tire back on the rim, the easiest way to do this is by using your hands. Use your hands and get the tire seated as best as you can. If it's too tight and you've got a small area that needs to be pried over the rim, I'll show you how to use the Cobra Tire Tool to do that. As you're putting the tire back on the rim and you work it around with your hands, you may get to an area that you just can't go any further. And I've highlighted that here with chalk so you can better see it. I want to use the Cobra Tire Tool and use this hook end to reach back up underneath, grab the rim, and then I can lever the bead of the tire back over the rim. What I'm going to do, take the hook side up, stick it underneath the bead of the tire, insert it, and then roll it over. And what I'm doing by rolling it over, I'm allowed to grab the top of that rim now and hook on top. So once I've rolled over the top, I am hooked on top of the rim, and now I can use it to lever and push the tire bead back on. Again, hook, insert it, and turn it over. Pry on over. Okay. The way the tool is designed with this arc feature, it pushes the two back and away from any pinch point between the tire bead and the rim. So we don't have to worry about pinching the tube. The Cobra Tire Tool can be purchased at our website, which is www.cobratiretool.com, or visit us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Cobra Tire Tool. Thank you.